How we doing folks? So, I'm going to do a wee unboxing tonight. So I've been looking forward to getting this. I'd like to say a big thanks to Pomeroy. Brilliant company. Uh, they great tents. My, my Pomeroy TP tent, you probably see me out in quite a lot. But they've kindly sent me, well this is a piece of resistance, a titanium stove. So this is the Key One Vision Fast Fold Titanium Wood Stove. Uh, 8.1 pounds, no joking, see compared to the other stove I've got, lights are feather. Right, comes in this nice canvas bag, sod. Right, obviously it's titanium, so it's got really good thermal conductivity. Uh, material wise, it's made out of one, me one, me one millimetre thick. Uh, GR1 TA1 titanium. So I'm going to get it out of the bag. I'll see what it looks like. But I must admit, I'm really excited to, to use this, and I can't thank Paul well enough uh, for sending me this through. So let's get it out of the bag and let's get a wee look at it. So. So, like I say, nice canvas bag. Right, that's the main part of the stove. So that comes for a nice and flat pack, like you can see. It's got the straps, Velcro straps, just to kind of hold that together. What else we've got in the bag. Right, you even got a set of gloves uh, just to put it together with. Uh, actually, so you don't cut your hands and stuff like that. You've got the flu. So obviously it looks small just now, but basically that's all going to fold out. So you can see how pack, uh, how small that packs down, next to nothing. Right, then you've also got this wee section here. I'm going to get it out of the bag. Probably should have brought a knife with me. Right, this is the section that basically goes into what's in at the top here. I'll show you that in a minute, sorry, I'll go that way. So I'll show you how all that works uh, once I get this out of the bag. So, first of all, we'll take the Velcro straps off. Right, and it really is very easy. So, top section, you see there, like I say, one millimetre titanium. Let's get the bars along the centre, just to kind of keep that in shape. Let's get the two hand tightening screws here, which will attach the other section on in a minute. Then comes the main part of the stove. So, as you can see, very, very easy to put this together. So, that folds up, that folds up. What I love about this, look at that, it's got a cracking big viewing, bit, uh, viewing window at the side. Right, so all that happens is, you probably see it here, there's two clips either side, so they basically just clip shut. Right, looks the same at the other side. Folds up and again the two wee clips hold in place. Right. Uh, then it's a case of the top section. So obviously the floor goes to the back. That basically sits on the top. Again. You'll see it's basically got all the wee latches. Put that side. Put that side. Just get the nice put a Pomeroy logo along the front of it. 
what I do like about this. There's different versions of this. You can get one with a viewing window at the front and the side. I think you get another one that's got no viewing windows. Or you can get the one with the, just the main window at one side. But so I'm really so looking forward to using this. So that's the main body of the stove, right? Underneath. You can see get two legs. So if I'm right, that should pop out like that. I really do like, I like this viewing window, the uh, stove I've got at the moment it's not got that and this, uh, when I say it's light, it is, it's light as a feather compared to the thing I've got so, absolutely over the moon right, fixed up you've also got a section here right, and that's basically your wee, your wee damper you can see that Brilliant. Again, titanium weighs next to nothing. Right, the way that works, let's say you've got these two screws here. I don't know if you can see this. You'll probably see it there. These three wee slats. Right, so basically you just line that up for this section here. Right, obviously you take these out. Right, right. right, so it's just two wee screws like that, and then all you do is slot that one to the top. Right, now you do it, get the two screws. And that basically just screw them down, finger tight. Right, that forms a seal, and then you can turn that round about your laser. Right, so that's that section there. Final section. Uh, is a flue. So you can see here it comes with two different circuits either side plus these rings. Right, I'm looking at that thing, so well, it's not a very big flue. It only goes to there, right? And the way this works is once I undo it, that'll expand a wee bit and it just goes round the outside of this section here and then basically with these circuits we'll tighten that up. But first things first, you need to kind of extend this out. So, basically it's just a case of loosening these off. Right, take that one off. Take that one off. You'll see these rings as well. Right, I'm just going to slide them off just now as well. And then, look at that. Can I stand back so you can see that? But you're probably thinking, how's that turn into a flue? Well, we'll soon find out. But it's supposed to turn into a really worse. So, I've never done this before. But it should. Right. So, that's that. See that basically rolls out, it actually rolls out to get a big size on it. Right, so then all you're really doing with this is you're lining this up. You know, you want to put this stuff up on. Put that all outside. 
and then doing again by just forming that seal. Right, we do get two of these so there is a spare one but end of the day that's us good to go so I'll give you a wee look round. So that's us you can see there good size of flue on it Obviously you've got the surf clip at the bottom and then you've got these rings that basically hold the whole flue in place. It takes a wee bit of getting up for the first time but I've been told supposedly once you've kind of burned it in and that it kind of starts to kind of hold its shape it's a lot, it's a lot easier once it's kind of heated up. I think as well because it's titanium it just looks kind of silvery just now but I think uh, it kind of changes colour once you've obviously got the wood in it and you, you start cooking on it. Right and obviously if you want I'm gonna obviously feed that with some wood. Right, I might not do that tonight, but I must admit, thoroughly impressed. So, let's like say I cannot thank Pomley enough, and they're a great company. Very, very, their service is absolutely fantastic. Uh, just second to none, just they really are really good. But, like I say, you can see it's got the folding legs, it's got the clips all around the sides. Right, you can see there, it's got the Pomley logo on the front. The light's not that good there. Right, it's got the clips at the side. Let's see, you've got your, your leaf flow there as well. I know they're also bringing out a... I think they're just designing it just now. They're going to bring out a wee flash, flash spark arrestor. For the top, so still to get that, but don't worry about that just now. But at the end of the day, it definitely does look very, very good. The fact as well that it's only eight point one pounds. I mean, you could basically, I could literally stick that in my rucksack and take it with me if I was going a, a reasonable hike. But I do like it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to spin you around. Just before I spin you around, obviously I've got to show you this, but let's even get the, the vents at the front. So another good wee design, and then obviously you get your wee clip on the door that basically holds it shut. But I can't, I really is, really am impressed with it. Uh, titanium stove then. First impressions, really good. Next time I'm out, uh, I'll, go out, I'll go out and I'll get camping and cooking with it. Uh, I'll get it actually inside the hot tent. I might even, I'll be honest, I might even get it out during the week this week. But I'll put all the links down below uh, to their site. Bringing out a lot of good stuff. Uh, obviously I've got the Hex TP tent already. Uh, that's me get the titanium stove. They're, they're bringing out another kind of nice tent. Uh, it's almost like a, a baker's, is it like a baker's built tent you call it? But best it is. Uh, they could ask me a couple of questions about it, and they were talking about putting a stove jack in it. But I'll give them a due. They've done it. They've designed it in, and I know that's why they're a very good company because. See if there's certain wee things you're wanting on your tent, they will actually design it in for you. Which I thought's absolutely amazing. So it's not just a case of you buy it off the shelf. They'll put extra ventilation vents in your tent and stuff like that. They really are a fantastic company. So, let's like say I will put the I'll put the link below uh, to their site and go and check them out. But let's like say brilliant tents, good stoves, just a, a good company all round.
back down, basically it all rolls up again the flue, stick the, the six rings round about it, the two surf clips either on the end, and basically that's it. And it packs down to next to nothing. Right, and then you can just stick that in the nice canvas bag. Exactly opposite to put it together. Just the two wee screw pins here. That's what it's off. You can see there. Goes in the bag. And it's just a case of make sure you don't lose these. Because that's obviously what it screws into. And to make it kind of tight once you get the fire going. Right, and then exact opposite again. Just basically put the these switches. Put these locking pins. Excuse the bloodiness there. Right, and basically, lid comes off. Gonna do these. It literally does just all fold. It really basically folds down. It really is, it's an absolute brilliant stone. So, like I say, I might, I might come out tomorrow night. I might try and cook something in it. But basically, that folds down like that. Uh, I'm going to do it, stick that back in, that folds down like that, stick another bit in there, folds down like that, folds down like that, then obviously flip it over, two legs, It's quite a, it's quite a, a stubby canvas bag. All packed up. Couple of carry handles. You're good to go. So, that's the Pomoly T1 uh, titanium stove. Yeah, I'll still try to put them on, but we'll get that in a minute. So, hope you liked that. Hope it gives you an idea of what the Pomoly Titanium T1 Titanium stove looks like. Like I say, there is three different kinds. Whereas, next time you see me out with it, I'll be using it. So, tonight was just a wee unboxing, just to show you what it looks like, how it goes together. Give you an idea of the weight of it. What it's made of. Just showing you the, the carry case. The different components to it but very very impressed with it so far even though i've never used it yet i've set it up we'll make the when i go to use it i'll make that a separate video because you know me i'll probably do a bit of cooking on it as well but that's it so if you like that wee uh, review video that wee set up video as always give it a wee thumbs up if you don't mind subscribe if you haven't already and hit the wee bell for future notifications so thanks for watching folks we'll see you in the next one